Hi everyone, this is Stephanie with Wayback Arcade's Tech Support, and today I am going to show you how to remap your power console to be able to play Robotron like you've played it in the arcades. We've been getting a lot of questions on if you can use both joysticks to play Robotron just like the arcades instead of the buttons, and I figured it out, and yes you can. So first, like, subscribe to our channel. If you haven't already, um, we appreciate it. And now, let's get to it. So, first, we're going to get into the Power Console. It's Robotron's under Arcade. So you're just going to select that. Uh, you're going you're gonna to search for Robotron. Um, I already did. Click that. And then now, um, we're going to play. We're going to go and go into play. So I'm going to show you what it looks like before. If this, this is default mapping of the power console as you receive it. So if you if you touched it, um, it's not gonna it might not look like this, but um, default mapping as you receive the power console, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Okay, there we go, a couple coins. And right now, um, default mapping the joystick doesn't work and but you can shoot. Okay, we can shoot. So now we want to be able to use both joysticks and play the game. So we're going to need to get into RetroArch and remap the buttons. So you're going to hold down your coin button, your player one coin button. First, you're in your quick menu. You're going to go all the way down and you're going to controls. Because in order for both joysticks to work, they need to be mapped the same. They need to be mapped as the, as the same player. So we're going to, and it's only a one player, I mean, it's a one player at a time, game, so we're going to map both joysticks as player one. So you're going to do port one. You're just going to double check. Your map port should be one. That is correct. Default, it, it automatically does that. Now for your port two, you're going to map your port as see it says play it says two we're going to map it as one we're going to go back we're going to go up to manage remap files and you're going to save this as a game remap so now every time you play robotron both of these joysticks will be player one makes it makes it easier we're going to go back and we're going to go back that's the middle lower button on your player on your one side and we're going to go back and now we're going to go into settings. We're going to go over, going to go to settings. And now we have to change the mapping of the buttons. So you're going to click on input and go down. We're going to, and this is in port one and port two. So port one, port one should be your player one joystick. So we're going to double check that. And, and it, you're going to see that right here. On my machine, is opposite, so uh, for some reason, generic USB joystick 2 is actually really this one, right? The player 1, and then number 1 is actually player 2. So your port 1 and your port 2 have to be your joysticks. So that is correct. And now joystick 1, you're going to be using to move your, your person around. As we... Um, as as I showed you, the the D-pad joystick doesn't work, so you can actually leave leave these mapped as is. Um, you can leave the buttons mapped as is. They'll still work to shoot if you want to still use them, but um, but if you just want to use it to move your guy around, we're going to the analog. So this is what the an this is the analog um, mapping, and we're going to have to map our player one joystick to the analog. So you just your um, lower left button. You're going to click it and go up. Just going to follow it down, left, oops, do that again, and right. And then you're going to do that again for this one. All the analogs down, left, right. Now we need to go back. So that's done. So now your joystick one, you can move the guy around. You can use the buttons to shoot still, um, but uh, but most important thing you can use now you, you can use your joystick 
to uh, to move your account around. Now, okay. Port two. This is where we need to remap your your joystick to to be able to shoot. So this these don't work. Doesn't matter. Here you go. Right here. A, B, X, and Y is where you where you need to uh, where do you need to remap. And those are your buttons. So those are these four buttons right here. Your one and your two and your four and your five. Um, we're going to remap as the joystick. So you see that A is to the left or to the right. Um, we're going to we're going to need to make that opposite. For some reason, it needs to be opposite. So we're going to you're going to click your button, your, you know, your lower left on your player one, and we're going to map that to the left. You're going to do this. All right, we're going to go, you have to use this. Okay, we're going to go down. So your B needs to be up. Your X needs to be down. And your Y needs to be to the right. If for some reason on your machine it's opposite, you'll know when you test it and you, uh, when you play and you can just remap it um, to your machine. So that's all you need for your player two joystick. So now we're going to go and we're going to save these settings. Go back and go back to main menu. We need to save your configuration. So now what you can do is you can save it as your current configuration and that'll change the, the mapping of your machine or you could save it as a new configuration and that's just an um, and that's just another file for this game. So now that we've saved our game, we're going, we can just go back. You're going to hold down your coin button again, your, your player to select, and we can see, we can test it out and see. So player one should be able to move the guy around. Yep. Be able to move your guys around. Okay. And then... Now your player two should be up, shoot up, down, shoot down, to the right and to the left, and all the way around. Okay, I'll show you. Okay. And all, okay, shooting all the way around. See? So now, that is how you map your buttons and your joysticks for Robotron 2084. If you have any questions, Feel free to email me at tech, T-E-C-H, at way-back-arcades.com. Um, if you have any other questions, you know, email me there. Uh, we just got a lot of questions about Robotron, so I thought I'd make a video specifically on how to map. Um, other Another question we've been getting, or another um, ins or instance we've been getting is... If you're flying a plane in a game, like you're the pilot, down your plane goes up and up the plane goes down. I know a lot of you know that, but just as a reminder, um, we've gotten some people saying that there it's the opposite, like that um, that they didn't know why like down was going up. So it's just opposite if you're flying a plane. Um, but this, we got a lot of questions. So I hope um, this helps, um, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks.